as big as they can get or can they get bigger? Wow. Good question, Race. This is an adult female. This is about as big as they ever get. Ava Tucker here with Expedition Earth. Like many other species of sea turtle, the olive ridleys will lay about 100 eggs per clutch each year, and if she's lucky, only about one or two of these ping pong ball sized eggs will develop into an adult one day. And unlike us Homo sapiens, she never had a chance at an epidural to deaden the excruciating pain of giving birth, and no Pitocin available either, another drug we have devised to induce labor after we humans miss the due date. It's all completely natural. <laughs> Then, in an instant, she uses her flipper-shaped back legs to bury the eggs and simultaneously packs down the sand by rocking her 100-pound body back and forth on top of the clutch. At this point, she's exhausted with her fight against the invisible force we call gravity. And what's difficult to understand is this is a marine reptile. It spends 99.9% .9 of its entire life in and under the surface of water, only now, for about one single hour in the span of an entire year, does she leave the sea to lay her eggs. She's compressing the egg so if a predator or a human would ever step on that spot, those eggs will never be broken. Take a good look at her eyes, pouring with tears designed to prevent sand from encrusting them and blinding her. It's another critical adaptation that enables her to maintain good vision so she can make her way back to the sea once it's over. The Olive Ridley, as well as many of the other sea turtles that exist on the planet, are at critically low levels of population. This is a look into the prehistoric past, a time when dinosaurs roamed the planet the Osa Peninsula, Costa Rica. This is Expedition Earth. Stick with us.